Aaron, it's been a bit of a baptism of fire for you, hasn't it? How much have you enjoyed the last week or so with, with the opportunity to play senior football? No, it's been good, especially at such a young age. It's good to be able to um, get the opportunities to play men's football and play in the first team, and it's good. But I've obviously got the trust in the gaffer that he's able to put me in the starting eleven, so I'm just happy to be here. Clearly, you've been playing an important part in, in the youth setup and yeah. been given the captain's armband. Could you have imagined being involved with the first team to such an extent at this point? Obviously, it's something that you, you want to aim for every, at the start of every season of, of a youth team player, but obviously it's hard to do. So at the start of the season, I was just trying to take each step at a time, try to get on the bench, try pushing the team. And then hopefully, now I've had a couple of starts, I'm able to sort of cement a place and keep pushing on. Yeah, the manager's just said that the back three today, you've probably started five senior games between the three of you in that position. Yeah. How satisfying is it to come away with a clean sheet? Obviously, no, it's good. It's, it's a credit to us because we've um, not, not really played together at all. So it's good to have people around you who's obviously speaking to you through the game, pushing you on. It's good that we were able to keep the clean sheet and get an important point for the team. Are you sort of learning all the time out there in every minute of the game, as you say, with things going on around you and, and people giving you bits of advice? Yeah, obviously, like, I'm not really being that exposed to this type of football, so it's good that I'm able to get exposed and obviously I'm learning as the game's going on and hopefully able to make an impact on the team. Are you able to enjoy it? Because obviously there's pressure on and the team's in a really difficult yeah. position, but do you kind of give yourself no, a minute? And... Yeah, no, it's, take yourself a minute to sort of take in the moment because obviously such a, like a, a good feeling stepping on and seeing the fans and um, yeah obviously the pressure pressure's huge but just happy that I'm able to play a part in it. Do you think it helps that there are, are a few young lads, I know Leslie Adekoya wasn't in yeah. the squad today but there's players who've come through the ranks like Dan yeah, Martin no, yeah. who's now starting, you guys do you know what it means to those supporters because yeah. you've come through the ranks? Yeah obviously we've come through the academy so having people around you is also huge it helps you sort of settle into the team and we know how much it means to the fans, obviously they're here week in, week out supporting us, so just happy that we're able to give something back to them. Two points from the two games that you've started this week. Today, very much a game of two halves, I think. Yeah. How does everybody in there feel about taking two points and the six available? Obviously, every game we want to aim and get the three points, but obviously one point's better than none, so I think it's important that when we do come to these away games that we don't come home with nothing, so a point's good that we're able to take take back home and hopefully, hopefully get some more points on the board. That injury list is still absolutely yeah. enormous. There's one or two getting closer to coming back. From your point of view, how much do you want to keep hold of that shirt now? Obviously, it's like I'm desperate to keep hold of the shirt, but at the same time, if I want the team to do well as well. So if I play a part, I'm happy. But if I'm on the sidelines, then I'm happy as well. For the are, you, team. are you able to look at Ross Sykes, who of course left the club in the summer but yeah. came through a pretty similar route to yourself, I think, and, and became an established first team player and think there is a, a route there into the first yeah, team. Obviously, regularly. having someone older than you who's already done it, it's good to sort of look up to them and look what the route they've took through and it makes you feel like you can do it as well. So it gives good confidence in you. And the manager's been quite vocal about if you're good enough, you're old enough, and I've got no problem picking young players. How much of a vote of confidence is that? Yeah, obviously, him, him saying that puts a lot of confidence in young players and it also other people in the youth team gives them confidence to try and push them and try and get around the first team. And of course the big job is to try and stay in League One, there's a big home game on Tuesday night and it must be difficult to be playing the games in quick succession Saturday, Tuesday. Yeah. How are you feeling about that game? Is it, is it physically mind over matter sort of thing? Exactly, yeah. I've got to make sure that the whole team's ready, the whole team's feeling fresh for the game. Obviously it's a big, a big game on Tuesday so hopefully we can push on and try and get some points on the board.